Roberts. Ladies and gentlemen, as a reminder, the championship is on the line here tonight. And in looking at the opposition, I can say that the champion will have quite the hill to climb in this one. A focused challenger about to compete in perhaps the biggest match of his career. Yeah, I am pumped for this guy. Big match here, guys, as the title will be on the line tonight. And the champ has looked dominant of late, but all it takes is one wrong move, and that title could be going home with somebody else. The champ has never looked more focused, laser-focused on the task at hand. Introducing the challenger from Manhasset, New York, weighing in at 230 pounds, H-O-O-K! And his opponent from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, weighing in at 227 pounds, the FCW champion, Chris Jerry. Social media is buzzing, as it always is, when this title is defended. Here we go with the title on the line. The stakes in this match really couldn't be any higher. Uh, you can tell these superstars are ready to give their all to walk out of here the champion. They might be limping out of here if this match is even half as intense as I think it might be. Down for European heartbreaker. Ooh, well planted knee. Ouch. with an elbow. Getting carried. Unsure what they're thinking. Oh, that's how you establish dominance. And that has to put some fear into the champ, seeing the kind of power their challenger possesses. Byron, how does this matchup require a different mindset? A superstar must be prepared to go all out, be as aggressive and vicious as possible. Remember, it's no disqualification. The superstars can do whatever they want, but it can only end with a three count or a tap out. A sound suplex. Well scouted. The champion's down. The champion's down. Oh my God, we're gonna have a new champion. New champ. No. Very close. The T clearly set again. Right down with a DDT.
Precarious position for both superstars. Oh, gosh. Oh, my goodness. Came down hard, and that could prove to be a game-changing moment in the champion's favor. And come on, no. Don't bring the trash can out. That's for cleaning. Well, Saxton, it's about to be used to clean house. Gets him with the counter. Denied with an elbow. Oh, right in there. Nice takedown. into the ring. Locking up the legs. Ah, oh, Cloverleaf! So much torque on the back. Cloverleaf stretch! The champ's back muscles have to be sore after enduring that attack. Achilles lock. This is going to be devastating. All oh, the pressure on the left knee. He's trying to fight it. He's trying to break out and does it. Understand the sentiment, but now is not the time to bask in disbelief. Close fist punch to the jump. That's one way to break up the move. Back breaker. Back breaker. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Determination in his eyes, and now a kendo stick in his hands. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. Going for it. Trying to step through. Roll on their belly. Being contorted. Doesn't look good. Right, this one's over. And he chooses to let go of the hold. But just the amount of time he was in that submission could be very significant. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. Launching, diving, brain chop to retain the title. Retains the title. Here is your winner, and still FCW champion, Chris Jericho. He wasn't giving up that title. No way. He's definitely fought to keep his championship, and that's something he should be really proud of.